Hi, this is Chris Hanbury from Series Squash, and you're watching episode 70 of Squash Shots. And today we're looking at the backhand drop, both on the bounce and the volley. So starting here on the bounce, uh, there's quite a few tips that I've written in on this video. Uh, so you might have to watch it a couple of times. I suggest trying to only really focus on, you know, one at a time and then maybe trying a different one. Uh, maybe what you think is an area that you need to kind of focus on the most, um, you know, and I think you know, a little bit different depending on the height of the ball, which I didn't really get into in this video. Um, but just assuming that the ball is like bouncing up a little bit high and you can actually go and cut it in short. Um, so hopefully you can try some of these on the bounce. And now here on the volley, the volley is obviously a little bit more difficult. You have a little bit less time uh, and the balls, when it gets up above your head, then the swing path is actually going to be uh, a little challenging and, and difficult for most people. Um, trying to move forwards when you can if the ball's coming in slower and uh, obviously if it's coming in faster then you're gonna have a shorter backswing and you're not gonna be able to use the wrist uh, that I do there to actually generate a lot of the spin that I put on the ball uh, so there are a lot of adjustments that you have to make depending on incoming shot um, so I think that's important to practice uh, those variations in your drills so I hope you enjoy this episode and we will see you next week for episode 71